The scenes of daily life in Ernham deal for the most part with farming, beginning with winter ploughing. The plough, drawn by four oxen, is painted in great detail. You can see how the hard soil is broken by an iron ploughshare and then pushed to one side by a wood board to make a furrow. Oxen were very valuable. At a time when a ploughman was paid five shillings a year, an ox was worth several years' wages. The furrow they're ploughing was measured in furlongs. A furlong, a furrow long, is an eighth of a mile. It was the distance the ox team could travel before stopping for a rest. Ploughing was normally done in January. The fact that the weather is cold is clear from the fact that the ploughmen are wearing mittens. But how realistic are their clothes? Look at the man driving the oxen. He's bare-legged. This was long before men wore trousers. Wearing a tunic over a long purple gown lined with black. He wears a fancy multicoloured headdress and a silver-studded black belt with a heavy buckle, which wouldn't have been out of place on Sir Geoffrey himself. It seems that the peasants here have been painted in finer clothes than they would actually have been wearing. Perhaps the artist wanted to exaggerate the wealth not just of the Luttrell family, but of the people working for them. In reality, the peasants' clothes would have been homespun, made from the wool of the sheep that they tended.